and welcome back to Fell Briganda. And I'm gonna actually start laying out my new house. The stone house I've been working towards and the stone house that I carved out that mine in order to get the stone for. Now, I actually like this area around the lake. Uh, and I might end up demolishing my little house here. It's part of it because I want to lay out quite a large area. So uh, let's go to nine here. This is the stone floor. So let's kind of lay out uh, a stone floor. Get an idea for the size of this thing. Okay, I can keep going here, I think. So let's get some more down here. I want to go in front of where that is. I want a little bit of greenery between me and the lake, so let's say across here now. So it's going to be up there. In line with that, across here. Just laying out the outline of the ground floor, basically. I might come across take out that dirt there so let's let's do the same here so we get a good idea for the size so I was putting one on this row so let's do that so the next question I have to decide is uh, how tall do I want or how high do I want the floor do I just fill in the gaps in the middle here and call that my ground floor or do I go up a couple of levels do you know I think I'm gonna stick with this just because it'll be simpler to start I can always move things later on I'm just looking at how many blocks I've only got. I have not got enough blocks to fill this in as yet, so I'm going to have to do some serious mining, I think. But, you have to start somewhere. And I'll probably fill in the floor completely with this block. And then worry about the detailing once it's, once it's done. I've got to decide on what I'm what sort of floor I'm going to have. I may well have carpeted sections. Let's dig these out while I'm at it. Oh, I dirt. Here we go. No, I want to leave that one there. So I'm going to have to tear down my base, my little ha dirt hidey hole finish this off because it goes right through the middle there. I'm gonna have to just be very brave overnight in the meantime. Let's see what's behind here exactly. Ah yeah that's gonna be a problem. Hmm. It's very hard to you can't move a chest when it's full of stuff. My chest is going to come right through at uh, this height, really. Oh uh, yeah. So I'm actually going to have to fill in. Okay, so is this chest... That chest is empty, excellent. So, let's pick up lots of this stuff. That I don't need. That was one of my urn from when I last died. Excellent. Now, I'm pretty sure it won't all fit into that chest. Hmm, maybe I should just move this chest outside, actually. Put it all back in there. Put it outside the realms of where my house is going to go. So I don't have to move it again. So, let's see, where's that chest? I picked it up. Put that down here. There, eventually. There. Now access it and let's move stuff back. Can I just click it over? I can. Excellent. Just a single click to move it over. Makes life so much easier. If 
fiber. I don't need that old sword. Don't need that either. This other stuff might be slightly of use. So... Yeah, so I'm just going through here. So let's take this out. Oh, those nighttime piggies are going to be out to find me now. Oh, that's how it's got to be. That's how it's got to be. Yeah, that one's too high. Hmm. Oh, I've got to move all this stuff, haven't I? Oh, boy. Start with this roof. Let's get this out of the way. Otherwise, I might end up bricking myself in, which would be bad. I need this grass, anyway, because uh, I've got to fill in this gap underneath here. Oh, boy, I need to move all this kit now. Is there anything in there? No. Anything in there? No. Okay, let's pick all these up and get these moved as well. I'm going to have to... Uh, look at that, I can't pick it up because it's got stuff in it. Can I pick out everything inside? I'm going to pick up quite a bit of it. Yes. Okay, so let's... Drop as much as I can in this chest. Um, I need that, or that, or that, or that. I need the glass, don't need the sand, the goo. Dead animal bits and pieces, I don't need. I don't need the dye, leaves, or the brown mushrooms. What I will do is get the furnace, etc., out here. Certainly don't need that. Um, because I'll, I'll be using them, and so why not put them out here? There we go. Can I move this now? I can, excellent. Finish off clearing up the roof. I've got the advantage that I don't actually need a place to hide like this now because I've got my bed, which means I can jump onto my bed of a night and um, simply sleep my way through the dangerous times. Aha, <laughs> can't leave that there. Away with you now. Let's clear out this whole little house. Well, that was weird. Didn't want to pick up the torch. Can't leave them floating. Okay, can I pick this up now? Can, can I pick this up? Can, can I pick this up? That was weird. It's doing that weird thing again. Okay, so six. Let's put that down. Oh, have I got more than one of them? Whoa, stop doing that. Put that chest there. What else am I carrying? Uh, picked up my bed, didn't I? I need that so I can avoid the knights. So, let's put that there. Oh, okay, let's put it there. Ah, right. Lays towards you. Okay, and let's... Get rid of that door. Oh, and let's lay down our teleport. It's just a temporary location for it. That as well, and that odd looking block. And I need to fill in this area now with grass. I keep pressing the wrong thing. To open up my bag, I keep bringing up my sword, which is just, well, wrong. I dug this out when I created my little dirt hole. Now I'm putting it back. Being eco-friendly, you might say. Leaving it as I found it, apart from the huge stone house which I'm building on top of it. Probably best we don't mention that. wonder what that strange fire sound was. 
Hello, piggy. Oh, I'm out of those. Oh, blimey, I've got through a stack of that already. Wow, and I haven't even finished the outlining. <sighs> oh, okay, got some tidying up to do over here as well. Yep, let's clear this out. going to have to spend quite a bit of time over at my mine gathering stone in order to craft enough units, blocks, to fill in this, this whole area. Okay, let's see. Oh, I could do it a bit better than that. Ah, I've got myself stuck. There we go. Let's pick that one up. I wonder how far this 90 is going to go. Not far, I imagine. Let's try, so that's only three rows. Whoops. I don't know why, but when you look closely at this block, it always kind of reminds me of... Look at the, the surface on it, it kind of looks like meat. Very weird. Like a meaty stone. It's going to creep some people out. I'm building a house of meat here. Okay, I think I've got enough here. Maybe one more row. Maybe. Oh, and a bit more. didn't go quite far enough. Okay, and I think that's basically it, isn't it? I think, oh, did it put it on seven? There we go. And now we're done. But it does give us a chance, perhaps, to think about what we might do with the walls. Just uh, lay a few of these down. Hmm. What are you doing, Piggy? Let's see, if we turn it round, what effect can we get? Okay. Okay. So we can uh, we can change how it looks quite a bit. Doesn't quite look like a normal sort of brick, does it? Something not quite bricky about it. And then we've got this stack stone. So I, I, I do wonder what I should do with this. If I build the walls entirely of this this brick, it's gonna look pretty grey. And this, although this lightens it up a bit, do you know what? I th I think I need some some wood. Let's travel over here, get some crags wood. Deforest ourselves just a little bit here. Ooh. Food. Okay, so let's just grab some crags wood here. And then we'll see what we can do with regards to a little bit of detailing with that, so. Let's just see what it looks like on on either side. So let's let's take out this. And let's check the bag. Where's the crags wood? Oh, I had some anyway. I forgot I had it. Oh! oh goodness me. Too quick on the keyboard and not clever. Quick on the keyboard, not clever on the keyboard. Gives it kind of a, a wooden frame construction kind of a feeling. I kind of like the way this, this Cragswood looks really good with this stacked stone in between. I'm not so sure about with the brick. Actually, I wonder if we take this up 
perhaps create it as a recess detail? So, uh, let's see. This one. So, if I put this here, I need to get up there. Oh, I can't get up there. Okay, yeah, so, let's fill this in a bit. So, it appears as a recessed detail between those pillars. That doesn't look half bad, you know. I wonder what Piggy thinks. Hey, Piggy and your pal Piggy, come have a look at this. What do you think? I, I think he's saying he likes it. Do you know, I think that does look rather good. And that's just made me think, actually. Um, I wonder if the processor can be used to do anything else with stacked stone. So let's have a quick look in here. I've got normal stone, limestone, slabs. Oh, okay, so unfortunately I can't do anything with that. Oh, that is such a shame. I was hoping I could perhaps make uh, special slopes or, or something, but you know, it don't look bad. Kinda like it. I wonder if Cragswood is is limiting me. Let's just grab some of this. It's ashen wood. Let's see what that does for us. That might actually look better. Or well, then again, um, I'm not so sure now because uh, the ashwood is sort of greyish. It breaks it up. I think ashwood might be better as pillars on the inside, perhaps. There's not a lot we can do with it by turning it, it's pretty much the same. And we don't want to see the ends of logs everywhere, so... Yeah... I think this wood wins. Oh, pigs. I think this wood wins. And I might perhaps use this recess technique here, try that with this stone as well. Definitely get rid of this. <laughs> Surrounded by piggies. Those crazy pigs. Yeah. I might... I might have a central recessed area in the middle of each wall. So I'll have this kind of brick like this. I'll have this over here. And then have this in the recess section. And then I'm going to have a doorway the plan is to have a doorway over here. Okay, okay, I, th I think we're starting to get a plan now. But I need a lot more of this stone floor. I'm guessing... I think that was a stack, wasn't it? So I need at least another... Just to be safe, let's say 300 of those blocks. I'll try and get that overnight with some mine... Actually, I won't be overnight, I'm going to sleep through the night. And tomorrow, I'm going to start chopping up the stone. Alright folks, thanks for joining me. I'll see you next time. Bye!